Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome. My name is Amanda and I'm a 29 year old living in the San Francisco Bay Area and I enjoy doing review videos. Today I'm reviewing the Blue Land dishwasher tablets. I purchased the Blue Land dishwasher starter set which comes with this tin and also comes with dishwasher tablets as you can see here. So today I am reviewing the dishwasher tablets mainly and wanted to share my experience with them so far. Usually I go into a little bit about the product as well as the pros and cons. So before we get started, don't forget to subscribe for more product review videos and let's go ahead and begin. Starting off with a little bit about this starter set, it comes with this blue tin and it looks like this. It says dishwasher tablets on the front. It also says blue land on the top. This is a reusable steel tin and this set comes with 40 dishwasher tablets. Also here is a look at what each tablet looks like. Basically a naked tablet. It doesn't have any plastic film on it at all like other dishwasher pods have. They are fragrance-free tablets and they do not come with the plastic film like other dishwasher tablets come with. They're supposed to be able to wash dishware, glassware, silver, and porcelain. And it comes with this tin, so from here on out, you only need to buy the tablets themselves, which you store in here, so it has like a reusable storage container every time you repurchase. I'm also going to read this off their site because this is a lot to remember, but it's also made without any parabens, phosphates, ammonia, petroleum, artificial dyes, fragrances, and triclosan. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but if that's important to you, it's made without all that. I think that's pretty much it for a little bit about these dishwasher tablets, so let's head in to the pros. So moving on to the pros, the hugest pro for me is that it doesn't support any single-use plastic containers. It is shipped in like compostable or recyclable packaging. This also prevents like those plastic bins or storage bins that other dishwasher tablets or dishwasher pods arrive in. So you're saving a lot of plastic by using this and they the refill tablets also ship in like compostable or recyclable packaging as well. They're not shipping anything in plastic. What's nice is that they come with 40, but I think they provide an extra two tablets just in case any break, which I don't think any of mine have during like shipping or anything like that. So that is a plus. You kind of get two extra tablets in here. I also really like that there is no plastic film all around each individual tablet like other pods do. It's also great knowing that there are no artificial dyes or fragrances added because we don't need that on our dishes. And the other huge pro is that I find it pretty comparable to other dishwasher pods, but I have to put a huge disclaimer out here because, because it's just me and my fiance living together. It takes us a few days to fill up the dishwasher and then run it. So because our dishes are sitting in there for, you know, like four-ish days, I tend to scrub off as much food as possible before putting it in the dishwasher. So I'm not used to putting dirty dishes directly into the dishwasher. So I can't speak to how powerful the cleaning is with these dishwasher tablets. So if you do load the dishwasher that way, I can't speak to that, but if you do kind of do like a pre-rinse, pre-scrub before going into the dishwasher, then my experience might apply better to you. So I feel like dishes come out as clean as they do with regular dishwasher pods from other companies. So I think that's really all that I could ask for. I don't really notice a huge difference, but I do feel a lot better using these because they are more eco-friendly. All right, now let's move on to the cons. The only con that I can really think of is when we pack the dishwasher super full, um, I would sometimes notice a little bit of the powder residue still on the top shelf of the dishwasher. So I think because we would block one of the waterways it wasn't getting enough water to rinse off the powder off some dishes. So I think to make sure that doesn't happen, we just can't block any of the water areas or waterways just to make sure that it has enough space to rinse off the powder. So when we do that, it works perfectly fine, but 
you know, for liquid, we never really had to worry about that because I think liquid just rinses off a little bit easier than powder. Because these are more powder based, I would just keep that in mind in case you do run the dishwasher and notice a little bit of powder, just make sure that all the areas where water is spraying out is not blocked or covered by any dishes. This doesn't happen with my parents' dishwasher because their dishwasher is newer and more powerful, but because we have an older dishwasher, we just have to make sure that the water can spray everywhere and rinse off the powder as much as possible. Overall, I think these dishwasher tablets do a comparable job to the dishwasher pods we were using, plus is a little bit more of an eco-friendly option, so I would recommend trying these out but I also will be open to maybe eco-friendly liquid options as well in the future. So I'm not married to this, but I think it's a pretty good option to explore. I hope this video helped you. If it did, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe for more video reviews like this. I plan to review the Blue Land cleaning supplies line, so stay tuned for that. Let me know in the comments down below if you have any other eco-friendly favorites to share for me to explore, and I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!